Hey guys, it's Alexandra Riley, and um, how are you doing today? Um, I hope everybody's doing really good. Um, today I am in my car, and I'm thinking, and something that's been on my mind all morning is, um, is something that was sparked from a conversation that I had with my friend the other day. Um, some of the things that she's doing right now and going through has really just had my mind turning on this um, concept of how much we truly hold ourselves back and how much we truly um, don't realize our potential and don't really go after, you know, the things that we can do. And it's so... It's it's so unfortunate that we live in a world that people don't have different conversations um, amongst young people. I mean, it completely depends on what circle you're in, you know, what social economic sta status you're in, what friends you have, what uh, role models are actively in your life. You know, all those things play a part of, you know, who you are and what you're doing. But I I hate that. It's not the normal to, to, to push yourself. And the thing is, is that we never know how far we can go until you stretch yourself. And we naturally, as people, will not stretch ourselves. We won't do it willingly because we like our comfort zones. And even if we don't realize that we like our comfort zones, we're comfortable within our comfort zone. So we're not going to go outside of it. Not, not easily. Not without a fight. Um, it's one of the things that my friends are doing is that naturally they're becoming products of their environment and they are not stretching themselves even though they have a, a mass a massive talents in certain ways that could truly extend themselves to places that they I know they would enjoy even though they don't realize it and um, you know you really you really have to push yourself you people have to acknowledge you know, where they come from and where they're at, get honest with themselves and, you know, get and be courageous. Just push through your own walls and your own boundaries, your own limitations and just, you know, soar through. You really have to be outgoing, you know, shy, being shy. You will not get anywhere being shy. And when I say you're not going to get anywhere, I mean, you're not going to meet people. You're not going to advance in your career. You know, you can't become an entrepreneur. You know, you can't um, live a fulfilled life. You know, when you're pushing yourself outside of your um, relationship comfort zones, you know, you then can create relationships with people in all kinds of places. You know, at the grocery store, at a retail store you go to, um, at a place where you get service done on your car. You know, life is about relationships and life is about pushing yourself. There's, I heard, there's two things in life that people naturally want to do. Uh, one, it's people want to grow. And two, people want to contribute. And if we do not extend ourselves, you know, you're not going to be able to do either or. And I feel like if society was, if it was more common practice to be a contrarian, to do something different, to, you know, push yourself, extend yourself, get uncomfortable in situations that aren't comfortable to be, to be okay with being better than, than what's the average, then everybody would be, it would be a much better place and we would be a more advanced community, you know, there would be more advanced communities, we'd be a much more advanced, you know, nation, a society, I think people would be nicer, and people would be more intelligent, but we just have this acceptance of low standards and expectations across the board, and it almost makes it hard for those who want to excel, because you're not accepted, and, and you know, in average places. And then it makes it hard because those who are average cannot step in advanced places and excel because you're not amongst that level. It's, it's, the struggle is real. <laughs> the struggle is real for young adults. And, um, I feel for all young adults out there trying to do something, you know, and, um, 
even, you know, I find these, I find some of these struggles amongst my life and, and I see it in, in my friends. I see it, um, amongst, you know, peers and my, and I hear about it from my peers talking about their peers and you just see it in everyday life. And I think one of my, my messages to get across, to come across that I want to come across in this video is that the acceptance of low standards and expectations is no longer acceptable for anybody that to be you know, outside of the normal, to be the best that you can be, to hustle, to, to grind, to be compassionate and creative and caring and strong, to be strong-minded, to not just be emotional about things, but to really, um, to, to do what's responsible as well is something that, you know, as a, as a human being that we all need to do. We need to break out of what's comfortable. We need to break out of your own shell. Um, truly be alive in the body that God has given you and and to to live on, you know, because, you know, we're God's people and we need to act like God's people and to, to live this life fulfilled, you know, and to know that you don't walk it alone. You know, you walk it with God and, and you know, we're meant to be amazing and, you know, I'm tired of seeing this. It's it's horrible. So let's let's be a better nation, guys. Let let's push through. Let's be alive, okay? We all can do it. I love you with all my heart. You know it. So go out there and be a blessing to others and be a blessing to the world. Alright? I love you guys. Bye.